save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, back again playing some more Breath of the Wild, finally! Hope you guys forgive me that it's been a few days since I was able to make another video on this. But we're back, I'm gonna be making videos as often as I can. We still have a lot to do in this game. Um, right now we are on our way back to- Ooh, almost fell off there. <laughs> uh, we're on our way back to Terrytown, which is right down there. Uh, if you don't remember, in the last episode, we found Grayson, I think his name was. Uh, the big Goron dude who uh, wanted to start a new life somewhere else. And we invited him to come to Terrytown to live and start a new life. Alright, Wolf Link, I'm going to go on a long glide so you can just chill here and I will meet you down there on the island. Alright, peace. <laughs> We're back. Yo. Hey, Grayson. Yo, hey, it's you. As you can see, I'm working real hard. <laughs> Hudson praises me a ton for breaking these rocks. We're finding some nice ore, too. My little brother, Pellison, even started an ore shop. Check it out when you got a chance. Ooh, he actually does. Look at this little guy. Holy cow, bro. Your prices are insane. I think I'm going to back off on that. Actually, you know what? To support Terrytown's economy, yeah. and seeing as I have more money than I will ever need, I'll, I'll go ahead and buy everything you got. Alright, how about that? I have more than I will yeah. ever need. It's all about sharing the wealth. Here you go, bro. Might have, might have started out with a lemonade stand. No, this guy went straight. This kid went straight to selling diamonds and rubies and stuff. I don't think I have enough spirit orbs. No, I only got one. Hey, Cookie, good job. You, you didn't do anything for the last uh, however long you've been standing there. Good job, bud. All right, Hudson, who's next? We need to keep expanding this town. You sent some Gorons back here. They're perfect. The brute strength of a Goron is undeniable. Those boulders don't stand a chance against them, and with names like Grayson and Pellison, they'll fit right in. Also, Pellison started selling the ore found within the boulders. You should go say hello again. Well, next is... So before we can, more people can move in here, we need uh, new homes for them to live in. Can you bring me 20 bundles of wood? Okay, uh, what do I got? I, I forgot we do need to get, okay, I have just enough bundles of wood. So we're probably going to have to get 20 more bundles of wood uh, before we can do it. Could you look for someone who's got a gift for tailoring for me? A Gerudo, ooh. Ooh, that's a good one. All right, I actually don't remember who the Gerudo is, so I'm gonna guess. If I had to guess, I bet you the Gerudo is not in Gerudo Town. I bet you they're at the Karakara Bazaar. I'm just guessing. I'm not really sure. And there's no uh, shrine to just get there really quick. Um, I guess we'll go to the Kano Shrine, and then we can just uh, run from there. It probably would be faster to go to Gerudo Town, get a sand seal, and do that, but I kind of want to relive the experience of entering the desert for the first time. And besides, we have the desert, or what are they, the sand boots now. So the sand boots will help us walk fast on the sand. No big deal. Not to mention I have three wheels of stamina. The first time we came to the desert, I don't think we had two wheels of stamina. Maybe we did. It's been a long time. This has been a long journey, hasn't it, guys? 
All right, uh, before we continue, I'm gonna summon Wolf Link so he can be our protector. I'm also going to summon two Amiibos, the Majora's Mask, because I'm trying to get the Fierce Deity Mask. Come back! Come back, Chess! No! Where are you going? No! Come back! Oh my gosh, I've never had a Chess go that far away. Yes! We got it! Today is our lucky day! Oh man! Alright, let's check out the full set. Oh man, that looks so cool. And this set has level 3 attack boost. Oh yeah, it only has 9 defense though, so unfortunately we're not going to use it right here. I will use the Desert Vo armor. And also the Sand Boots. I wish the Desert Vo set had a uh, set bonus to walk faster on the sand. You would think that it would, but it doesn't. Alright, let's... Uh, oh, I actually want to summon one more amiibo. Cookie, are you uh, are you able to come? Ooh, we're being ambushed. I can't I can't even see with uh... there he is. Daruk's protection is just like so big. I thought I, it's been a little while since I played this game. I forgot you can just shoot your bow with the uh, right trigger. I was playing a different game that I can't talk about yet. I will be able to talk about in a few days, and in that game. Uh, it's a it's a game that's not even out yet. Yeah, I'm excited to to show you guys, but I had to hold down the left trigger and then shoot the bow with that. So, anyways, Cookie, did you actually uh, show up? Oh, he did! Wow! Holy cow! Cookie actually worked this time. Usually, it says he's uh, not able to come. So, cool. Only a short distance we can take. Wait, am I going the right way? No, I'm not. Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. <laughs> Cookie, back, back, back this way. Good thing I checked. I was like, man, we should be at the desert by now. I'm just happy I get to ride Cookie on this old desert road. Underneath that giant land bridge. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, though, wherever you guys might be. Excuse me. Come on through. Hey Cass, how's it going? Yeah. Beetle, nice to see you guys. Yeah. I'd, I'd stop and chat, but we got a lot yeah. to do. Kalisa. Yeah. Alright Cookie. <laughs> Enjoy not going into the desert. Alright. Now the long walk to Karakara Bazaar. Oh yeah, there's one more amiibo that I want to summon. That is the Sheikah amiibo, or Sheik. If we can get the Sheik mask, that would be awesome. It's the mask from uh, Ocarina of Time. My favorite Zelda game of all time is Ocarina of Time. Ah, just an edge of duality. No thanks, don't need it. I don't even need to stay on the path. We can just go straight through because I got the sand boots. Save us a little bit of time. I think the Gerudo we need is here. I don't remember. I know Zumwar did this in his playthrough, but it's been a long time since I've watched that. If it's not, if they're not in here, then for sure they're going to be in uh, Gerudo Town, right? I just got a hunch that they're in here. All this stuff is fresh. What's your name? Savak. Alright, uh... Any, any chests in the water? Nope. Ah, oh, man, I love being in the desert. Benja... Robston? I'm looking for a name that ends in sun. That's, that's who we need. What about the dude on the lookout up here? I doubt it, but we're gonna try anyways. Nobiro. Ah, that's a that's a cool name, almost like Noboris. Oh, I forgot. We needed to to give this guy like an elixir or something. Never mind. I don't have it. I thought I had the elixir. I guess not. Oh wow, Beetle! How'd you beat us here? I just saw you at the stable. Rip. Wow, what a name. Alright, Beetle, since yeah. you're a magical yeah. uh, traveler, 
Let's uh, go ahead and buy some arrows. Can never have enough arrows, right? Ooh, a 10 pack. Thank you. All right, so I'm not seeing the uh, the Gerudo that ends in sun. Wouldn't it be funny if it's the uh, cross dresser up there? That would be hilarious. Wolf Link, you better get out of my way, man. She's got a quest or something. Oh no, she she actually. Hmm. Wow, she won't even sell to me. Rude. It's finally quiet. Are you kidding me? This place doesn't look like it's uh, ever booming. Savak. Hey, we found Ronson! Savak, who are you? Uh, mm -hmm. You, you're a Vo, aren't you? I am, why? Mm -hmm. mm, no, I bet Mama would have a problem with a delicate Vo like you. Oh. Wow. Oh yeah, so I'm Ronson. I hail from Gerudo time. Mm -hmm. The search for the love of my life. I'm so exhausted. Search? Uh, I don't know where I'm even saying this. It's no business of Hylian like you, but I'm constantly bothered by my mother over not having found the love of my life. Why the rush? Mm -hmm. You don't know, really? It's incredibly rare for a male to be born in Gerudo, so for our own survival as a people, we travel to find husbands. I've proven myself to be a gifted tailor. Oh, we found her. But none of the Vo I've met seem to appreciate a well-hemmed garment. I was hoping my craft would help me find a mate, but it doesn't seem like there's much work for a tailor around here. I wonder if there really is someone out there for me. Go to Terrytown! There's a big Goron dude just waiting for you, or a big old man with a really weird haircut. Eh, hey, what is it? So abrupt, too. Let me hear the details. Hudson and Terrytown needs a tailor. It's something, I suppose. The Akala region is kind of far away, but maybe I need to travel. Getting far away from a village full of I. But it's not like I'm accomplishing anything by staying here. I can continue my search in Terrytown. Thanks for all the information. I'm going to go home and pack a huge bag. It'll be a long journey all the way there. I'll no doubt see you again in Terrytown. I kind of feel bad. We're like setting her up for failure, man. There ain't nobody in Terrytown she's going to marry. But we do need to craft a craft tailor, so <laughs> maybe uh, somebody else will move in and then she'll find the, the love of her life. All right. We're going to go straight back to Terrytown. I know she's packing her bags, but I'm assuming she's already there. So let's go check. Uh, where is it again? Uh, oh yeah, up here. Back to Terrytown to get the next person. I know we're going kind of quick on Terrytown, but... I want to try to get through Terrytown so that way we can, uh, you know... Destroy Ganon. That, that thing, that, that, that main quest thingy. I want to do that so that after we beat Ganon, uh, I'm going to do all the DLC. And then I might be Ganon again, just for good, just for good measure, you know, because you can fight Ganon as many times as you want, really. And we are all right. Should I do, should I do a bomb blast? It's been a while since I played this game, so I'm not sure if I can do a bomb blast anymore. Let's see. Oh nope. Okay, I'm bad. Okay, that was unfortunate because the square bomb was still alive. There we go. All right. I'll take it. I'll take... Whoa. Left, left. I love the music here. It's so chill. Hey, look at that. Wow, she got here so fast. And she sells the same exact armor that I already have, which is disappointing. Nintendo, you should have... Made her sell a unique set of armor because she's an expert tailor. Come on, Miss Opportunities. You should really quit climbing on tables like that. It doesn't reflect well on your upbringing at all. Wow. Ooh, sorry about that. Wow. I didn't think she would have a unique dialect option. Masak, did you need something from me? Savak. <laughs> Don't you remember me? I'm Ronson. I mean, we met literally a minute ago. I've had to mend Hunzid's work clothes every single day. It's impressive how quickly he wears them down. Mm -hmm. Besides the holes, they reek so much of sweat, it's actually pretty rough to work on them. I tried to bring him up to it, but bring it up to him, but he got defensive almost immediately. You know, I came out here to continue my search for a husband. I wonder if he's the only kind of bow I'll find. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, or else, you know, there's there's the Goron over there. I guess if you never went into the secret Gerudo club, you would not have this armor, but yeah. All right. So I don't. Oh man, I need to chop wood. I don't think we can continue until I have more bundles of wood. 
I hear she's decided to continue. Yeah, you should stop by and say hello. I already did. 30 bundles of wood. Oh, man. Oh, man. Time to go chop wood, guys. How many do I got? Two? Oh, buddy. All right, I think there was some uh, wood here by the stables at this place, if I remember right. I'm freezing to death. Even if there's not the bundles of wood, look how many trees are here. So this is going to be a good place for me to uh, get some wood. I think these trees are big enough to where they'll give me more than one bundle. Yeah. I don't remember which stables it was, but there was one stable that had a ton of wood. Alright, I got 30. Should be good. This is not the stables with all the wood though. All right, let's go back to, I always think it's more south, it's way up here. Back to Terrytown. That was a fast one. All right, Hudson, you greedy old buddy. I got 30 bundles of wood for you. He's probably going to need 40 bundles next. It's finally starting to look like a town. I'd like to get a general store up and running, but there's no one with the connections and qualifications to run it. Do you think you could keep an eye out for someone who knows about distribution and can run a general store? Hmm, that's a good thought. Rito can fly around, so they should be able... Okay, we got to go to a Rito. It needs to have a son named- oh my goodness. Okay, so I have no idea where this one is. I'm gonna assume it's in a Rito village, but I honestly don't know. Well... Let's go to the Divine Beast Vomito and then we can just hop down. Okay, here we are in uh, beautiful, oh my gosh, the view is crazy, Rito Village. Let's start right here down at the bottom and look at all this wood. We're going to have to chop a lot of wood here, so might as well get to it. I'm assuming we're going to need 40 to 50 bundles of wood, so might as well start getting that before we even head back. guys so <laughs> I got 55 wood saved up uh, I may have kind of cut almost every single tree down in Dorito village but I'm sure they'll grow back new trees they just <laughs> they <laughs> oh man I feel bad look at this it's literally deforested this entire place all right so we need to find the Rito with the last uh, with the name ending in Sun there's Mosley, so he doesn't work. I, I use my uh, Savage Lionel sword to chop all these <laughs> trees down too. All right. What's your name, boy? Yeah. Hey, look, it's Fison. We found him immediately. 
Hey, evening. I'm glad Madoa settled down, but I have bigger problems. My mom said she wants me to take over the family store someday. Can you believe it? I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Aww. But I don't want to compete with mom. I wish there was a place I could set up my own shop. Bro, I am your destiny. Have you heard of Terrytown? Terrytown? Tell me more. Oh, so they need, are in need of a general store? That's literally perfect! But the Akala region, that's pretty far out there. Everyone says that. But I guess I've got to leave the nest someday and, I, and to have my own store. <laughs> okay, I made up my mind. I'm going. That didn't take long. I know! I'll gather some items on the way to Terrytown and then sell them at my new shop. Uh... Thanks for the tip. And hey, don't be a stranger. Come visit me at my new home sometime. Don't walk away. You better fly, boy. You better fly. Really wish that he would have flown. He is a Rito after all, but hey. He's got to go gather his stuff. All right. Um. All right, back to Terrytown. See what's next. And I already have a lot of wood, so hopefully he doesn't need more than 50. I thought, you know, 40 is probably where it's at, but knowing Hudson, he might... He might jump into 50, so I got a little over 50 wood, all from the uh, Rito Village, pretty much. And it, it only took, a, like, a couple minutes, too. It wasn't that bad. There's so many trees right there. So, we got the Goron, we got the Gerudo, we got the Rito. I'm assuming this next one will be a Zora? I'm getting pretty good at this, boys. Look at that. Woo! Ooh, a little bit of lag there. A little bit of lag. Not too bad. Alright, where's the new general store, eh? What is it, up here? Oh my gosh, these little stairs. These houses are so cute. No, I thought it was, like, up on top of one of these houses. <laughs> Maybe I'm just blind. But I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Wow. Ooh, he's got arrows. Oh, yeah. I like this guy. Look at all those arrows. Holy cow. He's got 50 arrows in stock. Oh, my goodness. What a steal. Thank you. Bomb arrows? He's got 50 bomb arrows in stock. I'll buy them all. Yeah, man, I'll just, you know what? I'll take all of your everything. I got way more money than I need. I would way rather have all these arrows and support Terrytown's economy. You guys are going to be the richest village in the entire <laughs> Hyrule Kingdom. What is this? Yeah. Some ancient gears? <laughs> I can't, I can't talk cheap. Okay, okay. Come on, Nintendo. Hey! Oh, hey! What can I get you? Hey! Hey! It's been a while. <laughs> Remember me, Faisa? It's been a while. After I left Rito Village, some bandits tried to bug me. Lucky for me, they didn't have wings. Terrytown is really great. Nice weather, no moms to annoy me. <laughs> wow. It's really great being able to run my own shop, sell things I want to sell, like arrows and a gear. Anyway, I'm open for business, so shop your heart's content. Yeah, bro, I just did. All right, where's Hudson? Hey, you managed to find a Rito and bring him back here. Thank you. He wasted no time getting a general store up and running. Apparently, his family runs one, too. And with a name like Fison, he'll fit right in. He's selling things that he's picked up while flying around. You should really go check out the store. Yeah, I just gave him, like, 5k rupees. Well, next is... So, before we can call more people here, we're going to need 50 bundles of wood. I knew it. Ooh. All right, here you go. This is going to be a big house. Is this like the mayor's house? It's going to be your house, Hudson? What's wrong? Oh, not that kind of personal. Actually, I got engaged. No way. It's true. To who? Oh my gosh! She engaged him! Wow, Hudson. That's better than I ever thought you would be able to, uh, to get. So, congratulations. You are a cute couple. Thank you. 
Wow, I'm I'm a bit shocked that she would go for a guy like you, but hey, maybe you know she's into guys like you. Anyway, we want to have a little ceremony to celebrate, but we need someone priest-like to officiate. Could you look for someone priest-like for us? Priest-like, huh? Mm. If we're looking for a per person devout enough to have priest-like purse, I suggest Zora. Good luck, you'll need it. This seems like a real long shot. Oh, and one last wrinkle. Yeah, they need to end in sun. Oh, okay. Let's go find a, a Zora priest, then. Uh, I guess we're going... Actually, Zora's domain is actually the closest big city out of all of the cities. So maybe this one won't be like, oh yeah, that's way too far. While we're in Zora's Domain, I haven't been to Zora's Domain, I guess I haven't been anywhere in a while because I haven't played this game in a while, but while we're in Zora's Domain, I do want to uh, check out the uh, shop. I also need to go back to my own house at some point because I want to I wanna hang up some of these uh, weapons that I found, like the Moonlight Scimitar and whatnot. The Zora uh, Greatsword over there, actually I'm going to go back and pick that up, I do like that sword. I, I love this sword, but every single time I come here, I want that silver longsword. It should just be called a silver greatsword, to be honest. Because it's a two-handed weapon. Alright, so we need to find a Zora, whose name ends in sun. Oh, wow, hey, Prince Sidon, what's up? Oh, we got a uh, quest here, awesome. la dee do your trial awaits. It's glowing bright. Oh, you're the Hylian who helped our Prince Sidon. You're so handsome. Wow. Your looks still don't compare to Prince Sidon, of course. But you're not half bad. In fact, I wouldn't mind ta talking with you for a bit. He <laughs> Wanna talk? Uh, yeah. That song. Tell me about it. Gift from the sky. Oops, I... I uh, yeah, okay. It splits the feet of the veiled fall sight. Your trial awaits. Glowing bright. Nice, so it's a shrine quest. I remember this one! I remember this one from some Wars playthrough because he struggled mightily with it. Uh, and so, because of that, I know exactly what we have to do. Uh, Sidon, no, you def- wait. Name ends in sun? Oh no, that ended done. That'd be crazy. Alright, uh, let's, let's head up. Head up, head up, head up. Oh wow, I forgot, it's not raining anymore. Why are the clouds moving so fast? It might be a blood moon tonight. Um, I would love to do an actual shrine at some point. What's your name? Tula? Nope, okay, goodbye. What's your name? Hi. It's Capson! Oh my gosh, we are killing it. He's got to be it. Well, well. It is always nice to have a visitor here. Thank you for journeying to our fair Zora's domain. You got a long nose, Cap. Wait a moment. You! Your Link, the perpetrator who forced Lady Mipha to join his crusade a hundred years ago, only to be destroyed by a calamity cannon. As though I could never forget that fate. You should know that the elderly here who love Lady Mipha still remember, and they still resent you. I, however, resent the deed and not the person. I also believe in allowing the mistakes of the past to wash away. Wow, so you're uh, actually not like the other uh, racist dude. I forget his name. Link, I have retired from my role as a priest. I am now living my life free from the material concerns of this world. However, ever since I retired, each day is more boring than the last. Spending day after day in idleness only to pass from this world soon. Link, as I'm sure you are well aware, the afterlife lays claim to all. We never know when it will beckon. If, during your travels, you meet any engaged couples, I would like you to introduce them to me. Joining two souls is a true honor, one I shall stake my life on. Just one more wedding, and I shall be fulfilled. Get a load of this. Oh, did you see his frown turned upside down? I've been waiting to hear those words. Now, please tell me the specifics. As for location, hmm, Terrytown and Akala. Akala isn't too far from here. It would please me to hurry there right away. By yourself? <laughs> no need to worry about me. I've always had confidence in my fins and feet. It's been a long while since I had work. I'm eager to put my skills to good use. You should come as well. I will start my preparations in Terrytown in the meantime. I hope I don't need any more bundles of wood. Alright, um, let's see. From the ground up. Alright, we need to go back to Terrytown again. 
So we've gotten one of each of the major races to come to this town. It's a really multicultural town if you think about it. It's going to be really interesting. You got a Zora, a Goron, a Rito, a Gerudo, and I'm assuming Hudson is a Hylian. So you got every every uh, race or ethnicity is in this. I guess they are races. They're completely different races uh, to Terrytown. And, uh, yeah, apparently the Gerudo can, uh, can have babies with the Hylian. I don't know what Hudson is. I'm, I'm, is Hudson a Hylian? We, 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 he must be. All right. Look at this booming village. All the houses are built. Oh, man, it looks so nice now. Look at the little roads. It's even got a doggy now. Look at this place. Look at this place! It's beautiful! Oh, how did that not make a bell sound? Again, Nintendo with the missed opportunity. How are you gonna put a big bell right there and not shoot it? Why you look so shocked that I shot it? What do you think all these weapons are on me for? Oh wait, there's more people now. Where'd you come from? Oh, good morning, and who might you be? No, who might you be? I don't suppose you came to Terrytown to purchase a holiday home, do you? Uh, sure. I can have another house. Oh, is that so? Anyway, please be careful. My husband's taking... Oh, you're... Wait. You're Hudson? Wait. Is Hudson your husband? Hudson got more than one husband? Oh, look. It's an inn. Who's running the inn? <gasps> it's Capson. He's running the inn. Hi. Link, are you in need of good sleep and a hearty meal? Yes. Thanks. To the benevolence of the goddess Hylia, I could offer you a place to stay. No, it's actually thanks to me. I completely built this town, after all. Uh, let's stay till morning. And, uh, oh wait, I can't even do a, uh, soft bed. They only have soft beds! I think I got an extra wheel of stamina? I don't know if I had that this whole time. Alright, thanks, Cap. And, of course, now it's raining. Alright, Hudson, where are you, you big goof? I don't... I don't see him. Where... Oh, ooh. What's going on over here? Oh, hey, you found Azora. Thank you, really. He and I talked earlier. He said that he literally was a priest before he retired. You can't get more priest-like than that. And his name is Capson, so I have no objections there. It really is amazing that you're able to find someone priest-like who also had an acceptable name, right? Mm. Well, next is... Of course, we'll have to invite guests in order to hold a ceremony. Guests? Well, I'm talking about my boss, Bolson, and his subordinate, and my subordinate, Carson. However, I, I've got my, I've got to prepare for the ceremony, so my hands are full. Could you invite them for me? Mm -hmm. Oh, they're back in Hateno. Perfect. That's actually where I wanted to go, anyways. Uh, because I need. Where, where? Oh, that's K Kiriko Hateno. There we go. I wanted to go back to my house, anyways. So that's perfect. Literally perfect. And then uh, that's probably going to be the end of the episode once I uh, finish up this Terrytown quest. I want to—I really wanted to finish it up before episode 90 because episode 90 is going to be the episode where we storm the castle, guys. That's right. We're storming Hyrule Castle next episode. It's going to be a one-hour special. Cannot wait. So anyways, uh, let's, uh, let's go back to my town, or my house. Alright, got the Master Sword back. Uh, where's my house? Oh yeah, there we go. Hey guys, do you want to go to a wedding? Uh. Wilson. Morning! <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Hans is getting married and he wants me to attend the wedding? Wow, good on him. Okie doo, I'm in. Wedding time, baby. I knew Bolson would like a wedding. <laughs> Not like there's anything to do here anyways. Well, I guess I'll get packed and head towards Hudson Place. Oh. Yeah, this will be fun. Okie doo. Oh. Carson, we're heading out. Isn't he standing right there? Why'd you look? <laughs> I looked away. Ah. Finally, we've been waiting for this day. Really? Well, at the rate they're going, they'll be there in several days. All right, before we head back, let's go to my house real quick. I just want to put some of these awesome weapons that I found on display. 
All right, let's see. Uh, as far as the bows, do I have a better bow that I want to display? I don't think those bows are pretty awesome. Uh, ooh, yeah, I got the ancient bow. So we're gonna. Ooh. I guess I'm gonna take the uh, the royal bow or the savage. Uh, I'll take the savage lionel bow back. I can't carry it. All right, let's drop that. We're gonna we're gonna take that, and then. Uh, we're gonna display the ancient bow because it looks awesome. Oh yeah, look at that. And then for the weapons, I do love the uh, royal claymore right there. Let's take the uh, the spear, and I'm gonna put up the uh, the moonlight scimitar. Uh, let's drop that for a second. Ooh, actually the fierce deity. Oh yeah, that looks sick. And then. Uh, I kind of want to do... Oh! Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. Actually, do I have two of the big Goron swords still? I had two of them. At one. I, I guess I only have the one. Uh, should I do the big Goron sword? I feel like I, I have to. Three of the best swords. Like, boom. Oh yeah, that looks so good. And then uh, for the shields, I actually do like those shields a lot. That that one is really cool. The uh, the forest shield or whatever, Quark shield. That one's super rare. I've only found that one of those in the entire game. And then of course the uh, the radiant shield looks beautiful. So I do have guardian shield plus plus and these royal shields though. Meh, that's fine. What do you guys think of my collection here? Not bad, right? Not bad. All right, last but not least, let's head back and uh, see Hudson and uh, Ronson, I think her name is. I don't remember. Uh, get married, and then uh, that'll be the completion of the quest, I think. I wonder what we're going to get as a reward for all the work that we did building up Terrytown. The best part about Terrytown is the fact that I picked all these people to come to the town. Like, I went and got them all. You know what I mean? That's so cool to me. Not to mention, uh, oh, we need to get there fast. Okay, I'm trying to, like, equip a different... They're literally all electric. Okay, okay, elect electric. <laughs> electric. Okay, I should be fine now, right? Oof. All right, I don't want to. I don't want to do this wedding in the rain. So let's. Uh... Beetle. Oh, it's a donkey. My bad. I I, I literally confused a donkey for beetle. Uh, where's the inn again? All right, there. Why? Why are you guys always sitting? Mm -hmm. Good morning. We're here. Talk to Hudson and let's get the ceremony started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, stop raining. All right, good, good, good. good. All right, lovebirds, you ready to get married? Hey, you extended my invitation for me, thank you. Now then, get hard. Carson and his boss are waiting for things to begin. Shall we start? Of course, understood. Then let's join the gathering. Now uh, this I wanna see. Are they gonna wear a wedding dress and, and tuxedo and stuff? They better ring that bell. If they don't ring the bell at the end, I'm gonna be disappointed. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> cough, cough. <clears throat> Silence, please, everyone. We shall now begin. We are gathered here today to join Hudson and Ronson in matrimony. Hudson, before the eyes of these witnesses and before those of Goddess Hylia, do you take Ronson to be your wife, to have and to hold in good times and in bad? Oi. I do. Excellent. And Ronson, before the eyes of those witnesses and before those of Goddess Hylia, do you take Hudson as your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and in health? And do you also vow to name your children in accordance with the Bolson Construction Naming Guidelines? Hmm? Wait a moment. Those vows are not... Traditional by anyone's standards. What makes you say that? They're as traditional as it gets. 
I don't think she means traditional in that sense of the word. <laughs> a vow of undying tradition. And a vow of guidelines compliance. <laughs> I'll take that vow. Wow, look at all this peer pressure. <laughs> think of future generations. Look at her face. Hmm. Well, those are the guidelines. I do. Excellent. You'd think they would have thought of that before this. <clears throat> and so, dearly beloved, please help me in greeting this newly married couple. The bell's ringing. I wish this new couple nothing but the utmost happiness as they set out on this journey of marital bliss. And I now pronounce you husband and wife. He didn't even say that. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. <laughs> if you did, please drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more Breath of the Wild. Cannot wait for the next episode. As always, guys, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next one. Take it easy, guys.